Welcome to State 5, a buying a storage unit across every state in America. Today we are heading to the great state of Texas and I figured, you know what, the top of a volcano would be a perfect place to start this video. Let's head to Texas. Last time in Colorado we bought a pretty bad storage unit but ended up with that big winner on the scratch off to donate to St. Jude's. Then we entered Texas the only way you should, finding a giant steakhouse, ordering two way too huge ribeyes, making sure they're way undercooked and then eating until you can't move. When you say our videos suck, we are down to seven seconds left on this unit. Are we going to win? It. There it is, and boom, $240. Let's go get it. Here we are, the $240 storage unit. First one ever bought in Texas. Let's open it up and see what it looks like. Well, I have a bad feeling that we bid because of that box, and the fact that I see it open at the top is not making me feel good inside. But you know what? There's treasures in there, and we're going to find them. And do not forget, we're going to have to sell everything on the spot in the state we're in, and every single penny we make is going to go to St. Jude's Children's Hospital. This is a community effort, guys. So every single like these state videos get, and every single new subscriber we get from them is going to put a penny in a pot for one massive donation at the end of the series. We're hoping to reach $10,000, and I know we can do it with your help. Let's get into that unit. We even brought Garrett inside for this one, so he's going to chill right here in the corner and watch us go through this one. Bring us good luck, Garrett. All right, let's address the elephant in the room. Whoa! No. <laughs> no. I thought that would be the case, but I didn't want to believe it. So, the TV box is empty. This is why you bid on what you see, not what you think. Make sure there's no other pieces in here. Well, oh. no. no, just styrofoam. Well, that's garbage. Put it on over there. Now, let's see, what is this guy hiding in the corner? I didn't even see that. Me either. What is the chair? There's the little, there it is. What is that? It is, it's like a canopy. No. I have no clue right now. I'm like at a complete loss. This thing, what in the world is um, this? Does this come out? No. No. What the heck? I have no clue what in the world this thing is. These are legs, so maybe it holds something up here, but yeah, no idea. Let's see what's in the bag now. What the heck is that? A vineyard, the wooden box of it. Hopefully it's not more alcohol again. <laughs> Let's see what's in this guy here. Is it ugh, closed? No. Okay. What is that? Oh, the air pump mattress. By law required, okay. every storage unit. Hey, okay, random eggs. Whoa, Apple Whoa. Watch, Apple Watch. <laughs> Come on, come on. Come on Ooh, home. that's heavy. That is heavy. Come on, please, come on. Please, 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 please. Please. Oh. Designed please. by Apple in California. Please, please, please. No. 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 Dang it. Well, you know, it could still be in that bag for sure. We're gonna set it right there. Let's see. This just a random empty jewelry bag. What about the wallet? Anything in the wallet? Bang. Nothing. Not even a dollar. Mean. We find cash, but rarely hey, ever find cash in a wallet. Look what? at the roll. Oh, that's full. What is this? That's full of pennies. This, dominoes. What is with dominoes and storage units? I don't know. Like, I feel like we find dominoes every unit, too. Why don't we have one random roll of pennies? That's weird. Uh, look at this metal guy. This is like the thing the waitresses use. Uh, what's in there? Open up, open up. What the heck? Why won't it open? Some tip. Oh, there it is. Oh. No, just the menu. What else is in here? Hard drive? A hard drive, yeah. Uh, gear, what is that? Belt buckle? We'll would find a belt buckle in Texas. And yeah, not seeing much else. What is this? That looks shady. That's a level. <laughs> NBA poster. Keys. And this looks like the wire to that game console. So I'm hoping somewhere in that unit that means there's a console. So we have a keyboard here. I see a keyboard and that looks to be a monitor. So I'm hoping somewhere in here there's the actual computer. My guess would be, I'd hope at least. But what's in this big box? Let's see if it's actually in there. What is that? A Sterling VMS vocal microphone shield. I don't know how much that's supposed to weigh. This box does have weight to it, but. I think a vocal shield for the light. Yeah, it's in there. Is it? That's what this is? Yeah. Okay, cool. So there's a big old vocal shield, a Sterling brand. I don't know if it's a good brand or not, but hey, it's in there. Garrett, we found more music stuff for you. Aww. Now you have a little microphone shield friend. <laughs> Look at them. They're getting along so well. Cute. Let's see. <laughs> What's in this box right here? Is that what it's supposed to be? Corningware, French white. Let's see if that's actually what it is. Let's open it from over here. Oh, never mind. <laughs> it looked like it was just stuck there. Yeah. Let's open it up. We gotta tear the box up. I hate when they put this kind of tape where you have to rip it up. And I can't, it literally doesn't open. We're opening it this way. I can't find another way in. There it is. The Corningware French White. It doesn't really say what it is, but it's just this Corningware French White. Hopefully it's worth some money. This bag right here, it's a duffel bag, but it feels really light. It looks like it's empty, unfortunately. Is it? Yeah, empty duffel bag. Just toss it aside, and I'm not picking that box because I can read. <laughs> I'm picking this one. Come on, don't be close. It doesn't feel very well. I read that one too. Where? Over what? here. Oh, come on. You didn't have to tell me that. Sorry. You could have lied to me. Oh, look, it's lying. There's fraud. No, no. 
Dang it. Well, that one's all closed. All right, let's move some of these blankets and towels and stuff like we usually do. These will just be local donations right there. So we'll give them someone to need. This big box here, that's more my speed. I see a random. Let's go in here and see what it is. Besides the Texas license plate, it looked random at least. Texas plate, these some curtains maybe. Looks like curtains. And just a bunch of what, kitchen? Empty box. Yeah. What's this? I don't know. A it floating looked, shelf. It looked like a box. It did. <laughs> then we have two pack magnetic fly screen. Hey, these are useful. I like these. Yep. And the rest of it though is just random kitchen stuff. I'm gonna get this big box so I can stack it on that box and we can have a table to go to the rest of the boxes. I'm trying to work smarter. Not harder. Good plan. What hey. does it say on it? Is that a chair? It says, ugh. It's a lumbar, air lumbar manager chair. Okay, but if that's- Please that be in there. It, Easy sell? No. Oh, okay. It's random, but hey, I see this. Is that really what I think it is? Really? Really? VHS tapes. A box of VHS tapes? That, well, that could, it could have been worse, I guess. It could have been worse, but not much. Definitely. <laughs> oh my goodness. Really? VHS tapes? Come on, there's gotta be something down here. Why did well, you store this box? Like, what was the point of keeping that? Seriously, what was the point of keeping that? Let's put an office chair and some VHS tapes. Doesn't that just seem awful? I'm picking one more box and then I'm leaving it up to you. Okay, I'm deal. I'm not having too much luck. Let's go with this one. Oh, that one's got a lot, one's got a lot of weight to it. Did I just see something over there? <laughs> I thought I just saw something move back there. It scared the crap out of me. Uh. I don't know. I'm pretty sure I just saw something move. Okay, great. <laughs> uh, great. Is that? That's why. That's why you said leave it. <laughs> no, it's not. I, okay, now I'm scared to open this. Okay, looks empty, or it looks like clothes. Wow. Uh, really? They're empty. Yeah, they're just a bunch of empty bottles. And then a bunch of more empty bottles. And then a bunch more empty bottles. Wow. Yeah, remember uh, what we agreed to a couple minutes ago? <laughs> yeah. I think whatever else is back there is all you. Great. So the first box I'm gonna pull out is this one. Um, since it's open, it's harder to lift that way. I'm just gonna go through it a little bit. This looks like mostly sheets and comforters. Boo. So I'll put that aside. Let's go through this yellow one. What is it? This. I got an idea. Let's say it says champagne. <laughs> is it? Oh, what? And it's empty. Why? Yay. It's all, why? Every champagne bottle that we have found has been empty. All right. This next is, is a monitor. It is an Asus model number VS208. All right. Easy sell, I think. Right? Hopefully. All right. Let's pull I'm down. I'm nervous one. now. Please. I know. Okay. Get one of these boxes. You know, this I, is what I picked this unit because the last one was so gross, and I was like, this one's so tiny. There's no way there's something in there because how small <laughs> it is. But I swear I I'm saw just, something. I'm wondering why it like these boxes are so dirty. Yeah. You know, and it looks like a clean facility. I don't understand. Yeah. But uh, this one said t-shirts on it, but I see jeans, so all jeans in that one. All right. Put that aside. I'm scared to go back here. I'm gonna go through this box last. Okay. But I'm Fair gonna enough. try to get all these. <laughs> I'm kind of scared. You made me be. scared. I didn't see. I just saw movement. I know, but now you scared me. I would be scared. Okay, this one's like really heavy. All right. Let's hope it's not more empty champagne bottles. I hear it rattling. I'll say that. Oh my God. <laughs> Why? What the heck is up with this? Okay, so we have four it's under it. Okay, that's a t-shirt. Let me the see what's under. Separated. More bottles. Yeah, look. More bottles. What the heck? Next layer. More bottles. This is ridiculous. Like, why? Who stores this? Why? Why? I, I just, it doesn't make sense. It doesn't, it doesn't, it doesn't make any sense. Well, you got four boxes left. All right. Yeah. What? There's like a bunch of dirt in between these boxes. You see it? Uh, is that dirt or is that mouse duty? I don't know. Uh, That's why I glad my gloves just in case. <laughs> I would guess it's mouse duty. All right. Oh, great. All right. Yeah. This one is just more clothes again. At least all these clothes are like separated. So it's like an easy donation. Yeah. Right? As long as there's not mice in them. Yeah. Well, I mean, I, <laughs> inside the boxes are pretty clean. Man, that's a lot of duty. I'm waiting for them. I know. So, uh, move this up. Didn't. No. Didn't. Didn't. Okay, not there. Didn't. Last one. Didn't. The last corner. Uh, nothing. Nothing. Well, there's also space behind there, like yeah, over there, there that thing could have ran if it was in here. Oh, okay. All right. What's this one? Say? This is heavy, Come also. On. This one doesn't say anything. Are you I swear. joking with me? There is more. Are you joking with me? I can't believe this. I don't understand this. I'm in like total is, disbelief. Are these like collectible at all? Like, will people use this as crafting? Uh -huh. Like, 
I don't even know. Like, I kind of want to try to... Can you sell wine bottles? I don't know. <laughs> I'm in, like, disbelief right now. All right, let's get this one. Come on, something. It sounds like the same thing. No way. Oh, wait, this is random. Oh, Yay. my goodness, something different. Randomness. Okay, Battle Buzz is Turtle Beach Guide. Big sunglasses. There you go. I like it. <laughs> I like those. Um, so this is the wire box. Hey. Is it a torch? It doesn't like work, it. but it looked like the... The one from the other unit? Yeah. Yeah. Um, some spray. There's definitely... Is those turtle beaches? Yeah, there's some random stuff down there. Hold on. Let's pull this out. These are sure, okay. sure headphones. There's a lot of wires, so let me move these. All right. Looks like some music wires, too. Like, these usually go to, like, an amp or something. Or yeah, a guitar. Definitely. Oh, look in that oh, jar. This? Yeah. Money! I saw some bigger coins in there too. Is it all regular money or is there like quarters? Uh Aww. it looks like quarters. I'll dump it out in a second. Alright, set it somewhere. Alright, here's some more coins. Electric tape. Here's a quarter. Okay, what is this? Let's see what everything is. Oh my gosh. Gloves are so irritating. Um, so this is the audio box. We found another friend for Garrett. Oh, I see Apple below it. Whoa! I'll just look down and I was like, hold on a second. Ugh, I can't get it. What is that? Mac Mini. Oh, what the heck? Is this like a mini desktop? It very well could be. Oh. That could definitely be worth something. Yeah. Hey, that's the what what the wire was in the first box. Oh yeah, you're right. That is. Hey. Okay. So we making have a, connections. Yes, we have making connections. <laughs> All right. Thread beast sticker. What are these? Power strip, reversible strap. What's in this black box? What does that Sterling. say? Sterling. That's the same that's brand. That's the brand as the mic thing. Yeah, this might be the microphone. Hey, hey, okay. There it is. It is the mic. I don't see anything other thing with it, but we'll definitely put those other wires with it. Yeah, definitely, definitely. So that'll go in a good pile. Anything okay, else? okay. Pop yep, filter. Yep. Know what that is. A tape measure, which I feel like we should keep. Yeah, it's a quarter. Bicentennial quarter. <laughs> Another quarter. <laughs> it's we'll a bicentennial too. That in the jar. Um, what else is down here? A mouse. I'll power strip i mean like a computer <laughs> mouse <laughs> uh everything else is just kind of junky so i was gonna dump this jar out and i found this this is a a scope that is called is it yeah hmm. primary arms okay i don't know cool. what kind exactly no, i don't know either. if you can tell but primary arm md-05 so that could have some value right there let's put this other stuff in here and see what kind of coins we have in here silver 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 all right, let's take these razor parts out. If you anything pops out to you, no. Separate it. Unity recovery service. It's like a False AA thing. thing. Right? Yeah. yeah. All right. Yeah. Everything else just looks like quarters. I don't necessarily see any that are silver. This is 67. No. Not quite. But I mean, still a good chunk of change right there. Pulled out another brown box. You'll never guess what's in it. Bottles. Like, this is ridiculous. Yeah, How I many of these do we have? I mean, at least three full of just bottles. And now for this wood box. It looks pretty interesting. What does it say? Nickel oh. and nickel? Single vineyard wine? I swear. Well, if it's, it's what I it's think it is. It's a wine box. So if I can figure out how to... Okay. Oh my goodness. Well, there's a wine bottle. It is empty, but I see there's some coins down there. I see a nickel and two pennies. Yeah. <laughs> I do see a nickel and two pennies. Hey, seven cents. We're back at our hotel here in Texas. And did you guys know that Texas has a $100 lottery ticket? Like, how stupid can you get? Wish me luck, please. Everything we win, going straight to St. Jude. Let's try it. Everything's bigger in Texas, even the losses. Then we plugged up our Mini Mac to the hotel TV to see if it worked, and it worked perfectly. Then we went ahead and listed the Apple Mini Mac for $120, the audio box for $40, and the Corning wire set for $55. Bucks. This already sold for $55, so let's take it to the post office. Gotta ship something else from eBay, so where are we going? Back to a dumpster, let's go. This one's a lot more dirty, dirtier than the last one. Look all back here. Uh, but a lot of what I need is just gonna be in the recycling but guys look at all these posters holy crap so i might have to grab those there's a lot of posters in here i'm gonna have to find a box and see what this box is oh look at that packing material a bunch of bubble wrap so i'm definitely gonna need a box for all of this let me grab one real quick just gonna grab a lot of this bubble wrap even some of this like cardboard because that serves as packing also that should be good for our corning wear every box that i move in here has like tons of posters <laughs> I wonder what we can even do with these, but I'm gonna try to grab as many as I can and maybe we can sell these off somewhere.
So I'm finding more than just posters now. Um, once I grab it all, just because I'm on my phone, I don't really have multiple hands. I mean, I have two, but that's not enough. Once I grab it all, I'll show you guys what I get in the car. Okay, so I've got all that I can reach. I got like five more here. Let me show you the back of the car. So I have the packing material in this box. I have a handful of posters here. We have a bag uh, with some stuff in it. Some pumpkin, like a car phone holder, a couple phone wires, a Halloween mask, another pumpkin thing. Uh, this right here looks like a Halloween bucket and another pumpkin glass thing and then a whole horde of posters right here. Then we grabbed some lunch at In-N-Out and then took our box to the post office to ship it and drop it off. We have a total of 43 of these posters all brand new in the package. I'm thinking we list them as one giant lot on eBay as like a reseller lot to see if we can get somebody to buy all of them who wants to sell them individually and make us more money for St. Jude. So now we have a buyer for that red dot site, but the guy wants to meet us in the woods. Kind of strange, but he looks cute and trustable. So let's go talk to him. Time to meet this guy. Hey man, how you doing? Hey, how you doing? Here's that red dot site we were talking about. Looks great. You all knew the $30. Appreciate it. Thank you. You know, you're a pretty handsome fella. Ooh, you too. Call me. Now we are leaving out of Texas on the way to our next state. We actually just sold that laptop from the Colorado unit on eBay for 25 bucks. So we're adding that to today's total. So in Texas, we sold the music equipment to a family member actually for $50. That sexy guy bought the scope for $30. Then we sold the laptop for 25 and the music little box thing we found sold for 35 on eBay too. So $140. So we're gonna go ahead and make the donation for that. Hit donate on that. The other stuff is gonna stay on our eBay. Maybe it sells in the other states. The eBay link's down below as well. And also that bar below, you can hit that if you wanna donate as well. And don't forget, for every like and every new subscriber to these videos, again, we're putting a penny in a pot for a massive donation at the end to hit that $10,000 goal, guys. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you at the next date. I've never seen these before. Oh, look, they're brand new with little wallets. So, is this all brand new toys? Ginormous pile. We can already well made the money back, and we barely touched the unit. <laughs>